humble obeisances to you. All glories to Srila Prabhupada. Um, thank you all for joining. Uh, happy Nityananda Pradashi to um, you, uh, to all of you. Um, so today, um, as uh, Maharaj is um, busy in the Bhaktivedanta manner in Nityananda, Lord Nityananda celebration, um, appearance day celebrations. So we are going to listen to a recording of uh, Srila Prabhupada uh, on Lord Nityananda's appearance. So I'm just going to play, it's a 28 minutes long um, video. Um, Srila Prabhupada gave this lecture on 2nd February 1977 in Bhuvaneshwar, India. So I'm going to play the lecture. Okay, so I hope everyone are able to see my screen. Um, yes, thank you. Thank you, Mataji. Bande Hang. The following is the lecture on Lord Nityan and Triodashi given by His Divine Grace A.C. Bhaktivedanta Swami Prabhupada on 2nd February, 1977 in Bhubaneswar, India. Shri Guram. Nityananda Prabhu is Baladev. Baladev Tattva. Brajanda Nandana Jai Pachi Sutta Hayula Sai. Balaram Hayula Nitai. Who was formerly the son of Nanda Maharaj. He has appeared as the son of Sachi Devi. Mahaprabhu, mother's name was Sachi Devi. So, Krishna. Krishna is Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu. And Balaram is the son. No, 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 Balaram Hayyanita. The Balaram, uh, in the Vedic literature, it is said, Na Mahatma Balahine Na Rukya Na Bhuna Sukhina. So, Bala means strength. Sometimes, some because of uh, the fact is the bottom means bodily strength. Uh, they propagate this philosophy that unless you are bodily stout and strong, you cannot achieve the spiritual salvation. Uh, you must be very strong and stout and eat meat and fight and then in the next spiritual step. No. This ball, this strength is defined. This is spiritual strength. The, the difficulty of the present situation is that actually uh, we are moving on account of spiritual strength, but they have no information of the spiritual strength. They are thinking uh, material strength. So that is 
एक्सप्रेस किया है अहंकार मत्त हो पद पास असत्य सत्य कर This is due to ahankar. Uh, ahankar of Imurata, Kataham is human. Uh, those who are uh, Imura, especially Raskar. Mura means Raskar. And B means Vishesh. Vishesh is not particular. Ahankar of Vimuratma, the same thing which is spoken in the Bhagavad Gita. Narottam Das Thakur says the same thing in a plain Bengali language. Ahankar of Matsuhaya Nitai Bodhi. By the uh, spell of Maya, Ahankar uh, of Vimuratma, Kattam. We are thinking that we are independent. Uh, we can do whatever we like. Uh, and this is called uh, Angkar of Vimurata. Under false pretext, false pretext, everyone is thinking that we are independent. Uh, we can find out the solution of the problems of life by material adjustment. So that is our material. The ahankar of the Muratma builds up. They do not understand that the real strength is spiritual strength. We see daily, uh, we see daily that a very strong man, very powerful man, uh, very. Uh, Good brain, very good scientist. Uh, so what is the strength? The strength is Atma. As soon as the Atma, the soul, goes out of this body, so intelligent, so strong, and so many things, but is that? That is the difference between dead man and the living man. Living man is very uh, powerful, very good position. Everything as soon as he lies down, he is lying down on the floor, and if you kick him on his bed, he will not protest. So where is that strength? The strength is gone. That is the strength. On the spiritual strength, the body moves. Suppose you have got a very good star, uh, Mercedes star or Rolls Royce star, but when there is no petrol, how the car will move? It is not possible. There is spirit, petrol spirit. Uh, similarly, the real strength is spiritual strength. That spiritual strength is Balaram. Balaram is strength. Therefore, uh, we have to take shelter of the lotus feet of Balaram, Guru Tat. Balaram means Guru Tat. Balaram represents uh, Guru. The uh, Sat Prasada, Bhagavat Prasada. If you want to understand Chaitanya Mahaprabhu, if we want to understand Krishna. Then we must take shelter of Balaram. Now, what my Balahin is not love. The Balahin is not love. For the Vedic Jansan means without the mercy of Balaram, you cannot understand. You cannot realize your spiritual identity. So that Balaram comes as the Taram Guru. Balaram is the Taram. Therefore, we must take shelter of Balaram. Uh, that is, this song has been sung by Narottam Das Thakur. Nitai pada kamala pati chandra sushi. 
and we are maintaining a family of 10,000 men. We have no anger. Let's see practice. We have no anger. We require thousands and thousands of rupees for maintaining Europe, America, a costly affair. But uh, because we are uh, under the center of Nithyananda Prabhu, Paradam, we have no anxiety. Uh, that means material life means anxiety. You cannot avoid anxiety if you lead a material life. Then you will be anxious. That is Prahlad Maharaj's instruction. Hmm. <coughs> you are asked by his father, my dear son, what you have learned the best thing from your teacher. So he replied, my dear father, he never said my dear father, he said, uh, my dear, best of the Osuras. Osura was the sadhu manne suravadda dheena. Sadhu manne suravadda dheena. Sada samadhu vigna dhyam asadhugra. The whole human society is suffering, at least suffering from one disease, anxiety. Uh, ask anybody. Take one small ant and take the big elephant, take the President of the United States, or take one street beggar, ask him whether you are free from anxiety. Nobody will say, no. I am poor. Uh, that's a fact. So why is there anxiety? I'm full of anxiety. Uh, that Pallad Maharaj is right. Because they have taken asad vastu, that will not exist. Everything, whatever we are, our, this body will not exist. And this is the uh, main platform of our existence. In the material world, so long the body is there, you exist. <laughs> so, Pallad Maharaj said that a real solution of problems of life uh, is to uh, get out of this material condition. That is best thing, in my opinion. That is Vedic injunction. Asakuruma, Sadhama. Don't live in this asak. In this material condition. Uh, Sadhgama, go to real existence. The real existence means spiritual life. Nahannate Hannamane Sadhguru. So, if we actually want uh, life, a blissful life, then we must get out of this material life. <laughs> That is for Lama. And if you remain in the material existence, you must suffer from anxiety. There is no excuse. So, Pallad Maharaj advises that Vityatma Dhatam Vrihanda Kupam Bhananda Tujala Srimatma Yuta. If you, real problem is anxiety. And this anxiety will continue so long you are material existence. Therefore, the real life is to get out of this material idea. Hitya atmodhatam. Atmodhatam. Atmodhatam means killing the soul. This material civilization is killing the soul. If they have no information of the soul, they do not know how to become peaceful, how to become blissful. They are trying to be peaceful by by external material energy. They are thinking by constructing big, big buildings, just like in Bhuvaneswar they are doing, and having good, uh, very big, big roads and motor cars. That is advancement of civilization. No, that is not advancement. Uh, 
that is increasing the anxiety. Uh, there is no solution of the anxiety. Uh, very formally that I was thinking, there was no university. Uh, the university was in the cottage, best day. Best day was writing Srimad Bhagavatam and all the Puranas in the cottage. The university was there. Who can produce such literature? as Vaisdev has given, uh, from any angle of vision, from literary point of view, from philosophical point of view, everything, so perfect, every literature, Mahabharata, Puranas, and Vedanta, Vedu Vaisdev, he has given. So, there was no need of university. He required clear brain. Uh, that was to be done by the Brahminical qualification. Dhamma, Dhamma, to the charge of all. Jnana, Vityana, Mahatri, Sambrahma, Dhamma, Sahaja. Where is that education? Uh, this education, technical education, how you can very nicely hammer. Uh, this will not solve the problem. So if you want real solution of the problem, then our duty is, first of all, to take the shelter of the type of the common. Uh, then we'll be happy and we'll get uh, moon sign and our all happiness will be subsided. Then we say, Sambandha nahi jar, vitha janma galotha. If you have no Connection with Nityananda Prabhu. Nityananda means always. Nitya means always. Ananda means pleasure. Hmm. This is another you can mean you can draw. Therefore, if you have no connection with Nityananda Prabhu, say Sambandha Nahija. Vrithaj and water. He simply wasting that. Vritha means useless. Uselessly he is wasting time. Uh, Say Pasu Boruguraja. And Natanda Sako has used very strong one. Anyone who has no connection with Nityananda Prabhu, he is a Pasu. Say Pasu. He is a Pasu, means animal. The animal house, one animal can get happiness, that is not possible. The dog. From the childhood, he is searching after food, searching after food. I cannot get food unless a dog has got a master. Uh, he is a dog and he is always unhappy. Uh, so better to become a dog of Nityananda Prabhu, then he shall be happy. Instead of becoming dog of so many other people, everyone is dog. Everyone is searching after to serve a master, but none of them are satisfied because there is false master. To take real master, Nityananda Prabhu, he will be happy. Uh, he does not know where is happiness, where I shall become a dog. Uh, that um, our Bhaktuna Thakur, he has sung therefore. Vaishnava Thakur, Tomara Kukur, Boliya Jano Mori. My dear Vaishnava Thakur, can you accept me as your dog? As your dog. I am dog already, but I am Maya's dog. I am not Vaishnava's dog. So can you accept me? Uh, if you become a Vaishnava's dog, Charya Vaishnava Seva, Nishtar Peche Keva. Uh, if you do not become a dog of Vaishnava, uh, uh, Nityananda Prabhu, Nityananda is Guru, uh, so if you do not become a dog of Nityananda Prabhu, Vaishnava, a Guru, there is no question of uh, happiness. Te sambandha nahi jaya dhikhajan bhaja, kei posu bharo duracha, nitaina bolilo mukhe mojilo samisharo. 
he has no connection with uh, Nityananda Prabhu. And he does not say, Jai Nitai, Jai Lo. As a modular samsara. He thinks that this society, family, and uh, society, fancy man, love, divinely best of love, man, materialist person, they say like that. Uh, that is called modular samsara. And samsara, there cannot be any soul, but he is attracted. <coughs> modular samsara. Vidya kule ki kori What will do in university education or born in a big family? <laughs> this is not possible. Vidya kule ki kori Why they are accepting this part? Ahankare mapta hiya. Nitai pato paso hiya. Asatare satya kori na. On account of being misled by false prestige uh, and false uh, illusion, asatare sattva guru. We are accepting this body. It is asat. It does not exist. Uh, and that we are accepting as we are living. Ahankara matta hiya, nitai pato pato hiya. But if we take that for a mitana and the then we get the enlightenment. Asatara Sattva Parimani Nitaer Koruna Havi Brajir Adha Krishna Prabhu Dara Nitaer Dara Nitaer Nathan Dathaku advises that today is Nitananda Prabhu Havi Bha appearance day. Let us at least remember today Nitaer for the Kamala. That is what Nitaer Charana Sattva Tahara Shivakan Nitya. The reality is Nitai Sarana, and anyone who is servant of Nitai, so Nitai Sarana Sattva, Tahara Shivakan Nitya, one who has become the dog of Nitananda Prabhu, he gets his eternal life. <coughs> we are eternal, but under misconception of material identification. We are under the subjugation of Maya, Buddha, Buddha, Padya. Tatha, Dehanda, this is very bothersome, but they do not know. Uh, uh, going from one body to another, that's my vision, and that is not guaranteed for kind of body. They have no science, no knowledge about understanding the Thad Dehanta, the very first instruction of Bhagavad Gita. They are so rascals and they are proud of their education, their university. This is very much. Nitai Charana Sattva Tahara Sivavan. Nitai Pada Sada Karvahat. Therefore, we should always expect uh, to be under the shelter of Nitai Pada Kamala Narottama. Uh, Narottamdasthakur is Acharya. He is uh, presenting himself. Uh, that is Acharya. I mean, he is not Dukhi, but he is presenting himself as Dukhi. That is Acharya. Uh, Acharya is there, ne never Dukhi. But taking the common man's position, he says Narottama Bharadukhi. Or in other words, Narottam, Narottam is the best of the human being. So here, in this material world, one may be the best of the human being, very exalted position, but everyone is dukhi, unhappy. Narottam is very dukhi. Nitai mare karoti. Only Nityananda can make me happy. Other is not possible. <coughs> Rakha Ranga Chodanera. So, today is Nithananda Prabhu that we have said. We shall always pray, Nithananda Prabhu, kindly keep me under your shelter so that uh, I am very lucky, I am very unhappy. Uh, under the shelter of your local space, I shall be happy. And that is the other. Thank you. Yeah, yeah.
Hare Krishna, everyone. Uh, thank you so much for uh, listening patiently um, to the class. Um, it's such a wonderful class by uh, Srila Prabhupada, emphasizing the importance of uh, Nityananda Dharadasi and what is the mood we should have today. I just want to, um, so as uh, uh, Srila Prabhupada was mentioning uh, about the bhajan, Vitai Pada Kamala, I want to play that bhajan uh, too. So give me one second, I'll just... Uh, So in the meanwhile, um, if anybody wants to share any realization um, or you have any comments about what um, Srila Prabhupada spoke just now, so you can please go ahead. You can unmute yourself and you can start. Um, Yes, Risha Prabhu, yes. Um, Srila Prabhupada wants us to be like a dog, um, become a dog of Nityananda, Lord Nityananda. And uh, yeah, he quoted uh, verses from Srimad Bhagavatam and Bhagavad Gita, and he's trying to explain us that um, in this material world, we have a lot of suffering and anxiety. And when we take shelter of Lord Nityananda's lotus feet, um, we'll be able to. Uh, at least uh, get the mercy of Lord Nityananda and uh, somehow go back to Godhead. Um, yeah. That's true. That's true. I'm playing this. I don't know. Um, should be or not. Okay, so in the mean, otherwise, what we'll do, um, we'll go to sorry, today I'm not prepared. Um, Okay, I'm sharing my screen. Let's hear the bhajan. Tai Pada Kamala Koti Chandra Susitala Nitai Pada Kamala Koti Chandra Susitala Jechaya
You are on mute. Sorry. Can anybody wants to um, read the translation of this bhajan? We just hear it's such a wonderful uh, bhajan, right? So anybody wants to read the translation, which is displayed on the screen? Mataji's or Prabhuji's? Okay. 
nicht, ne? Okay. I can read it. Um, so the translation, uh, first, the lotus feet of Lord Nityananda are a shelter where one will get the soothing moonlight, not only of one, but millions of, of moons. If the world wants to have real peace, it should take shelter of Lord Nityananda. Unless one takes shelter under the shade of the lotus feet of Lord Nityananda, it will be very difficult for him to approach Radha Krishna. If one actually wants to enter into the dancing party of Radha Krishna, he must firmly catch hold of the lotus feet of Lord Nityananda. Anyone who has not established his relationship with Nityananda Prabhu is understood to have spoiled his valuable human birth. Such a human being is actually an uncontrollable animal. Because he never uttered the holy name of Nityananda, he has become merged into so-called material happiness. What can his useless education and family tradition do to help him? Being maddened after false prestige and identification with the body, one is thinking, oh, what is Nityananda? What can he do for me? I don't care. The result is that he is accepting something false to be truth. If you actually want to approach the association of Radha Krishna, you must first achieve the mercy of Lord Nityananda. When he is merciful toward you, then you will be able to approach Radha Krishna. Therefore, you should firmly grasp the lotus feet of Lord Nityananda. Number four, the lotus feet of Lord Nityananda are not illusion, they are a fact. One who engages in the transcendental loving service of Nityananda is also transcendental. Always try to catch the lotus feet of Lord Nityananda. This Narottama Dasa is very unhappy. Therefore, I am praying to Lord Nityananda to make me happy. My dear Lord, please keep me close to your lotus feet. Jai. This is written by Srila Narottama Das Thakur. Such a wonderful budget. Thank you all so much for being online. Um, Sonal Mataji, I saw your question. I think we can ask uh, uh, Guru Maharaj when he comes online. So, Saturday... Uh, Maharaj will give class. So if you can join on that day and uh, ask this question, then you can get your answer. Maharaj. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Anybody wants to share anything before we close the call? I guess in India it is um, tomorrow. Uh, it's 22nd. For London, for UK and... Uh, Europe and USA, it is today. Lord Nityananda Srayadash. Okay. Thank you all so much. Um, um, happy Nityananda Srayadashi to everyone. And uh, we can end the call here. Tomorrow we'll join with one more class. Uh, hopefully, uh, Maharaj is not available tomorrow, but uh, somebody will give class. So, thank you so much for joining. Um, thank you. Very have a blissful day. And check out the Rubis check, repass in the Bay, which I can't have any of us to make you on a Munama. The Nithian that I have to see key jai, 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 Jai. Thank you, thank you, everyone. Thank you, Hare Krishna. Thank you, Hare Krishna.